three-game series between the Sox and the Tigers. Detroit and Chicago tied in the 10th. By the way, that runner at second now is a permanent addition to the rule book. It's an actual rules change for 2023, even though they've been doing it before. They've been doing it on the memo basis. Now it's an actual official baseball rule. So how about that? Second intentional walk of Gavin Sheets in the last three innings. There he goes. Chicago so loads the bases on an intentional yes. walk and hit by pitch. Of course, it's challenged. It was hit by pitch. There you go. Yes, I mean, you... Important to note, baseball is not one of those hand part of the ball sports. It's not basketball. Baseball rule is a pitch ball touching a batter who is not attempting to strike it and who does not, not double negative, attempt to avoid it. So the batter here tries to avoid it by trying to check their swing, gets hit in the wrist during it. That's a hit by pitch. All right, one more thing to look at. The line at first, and Tim takes the ball away. It slightly gets away. Nobody can find it, and the Sox win. And Chicago walks it off. This is a very bizarre scene. On the one hand, you have the team celebrating, and on the other side, the umpire is hurt. The good news about this play, getting hit in the head like that on the last pitch of the game, if there is any, is... You don't have to debate whether to come out or stay in because the game is over. One question I'll get asked on the play, is it interference? And this is not umpire interference. Remember, there are only two types. Catcher hitting the umpire, getting interfered with trying to retire a runner. And type two is a batted ball, touching an umpire before it passes an infielder, provided it, it did not first touch the pitcher. Those are the only umpire interference plays. Other than that, the ball remains live, and that's what occurred here. Pitch ball to the umpire's head. Ball's live. Sox win. Hit him right square in the mask. Somehow Haas missed it. I want to point out what Blazer does after getting hit. Look at the umpire. After getting hit, he goes down, takes his mask off, looks for the baseball, because he knows the play is live. He still has to officiate it. That's very good umpiring. I also love the catcher and the batter going straight to the umpire, especially the catcher, because you're on defense, you have a chance to guard against that run, and he goes straight to the ump. Some things are more important than baseball and winning, and I'm just very impressed to see that. Visit us online at CloseCallSports.com, Twitter and Facebook at Close Call Sports. Subscribe, and we'll see you on the site. Both runs for Chicago score on wild pitches.